on guys, welcome back to DS First Day. We're going to be talking about the Pat Nishik trade, him going to Colorado, not Washington for some reason. Um, but let's just get into it on outside because I have no room at the place I'm staying, but well, we'll have to deal with it. But I'll have to also have to be making a video tomorrow, I'm pretty sure. Um, so it's probably going to be another place, but you never know. But I'm going to get through this pretty quickly. Um, probably going to be like a three minute video, we'll see. Um, but. Phillies get a pretty decent haul for Nishek, in my opinion. Um, Jose Gomez looks to be a great, great prospect. He looks to be fantastic third baseman. Um, he might, he might be, he's going to be starter someday for them. Um, I don't think Franco will turn out, but we'll have to see. Um, Jose will be a big plus one because average is so high. Um, he has lots, he gets on base a lot. Um, He's able to do a lot of things. He's a good, great fight player as well. Um, and then JD Hammer, um, great name by the way. But um, he's a, he looks he's doing really well in single A. Um, he looks to be he has a great ERA. I think he's under two um, or around there. Um, and he looks to be a great prospect. He might he might turn out to be something. Um, I, I'm rejecting the maybe starter for the Phillies because they don't got the best rotation. In, they don't got the best team, but I don't know. And then Andreano Aquina or whatever are you whatever I don't even know. Names are tough. They definitely are. Um, he doesn't look to be too terrible. Oh, we'll have to wait and see. So, um, I mean, they get a decent haul. It's definitely because it's pretty much a rental. I don't know if Patty should go retire, but we'll have to wait and see. So, we'll have to. I'll have to wait and see how this trade goes, though. I will make a beat making another video, so stay tuned for that, but I'm going to see you guys later. Goodbye.